Shri Jayawardnipura Kote or Shri Jayawardnipura Kote, also known as Kote, is the official capital of Sri Lanka. The village of Darugamale at the confluence of two streams, the Dawana Oi and the Kalanawa Oi Ae. As Darugama was a naturally secure place, it was not easy for enemies to enter it. Here, in the 13th century, a chieftain named Nisankala Gakanara built a fortress called Kote, meaning fortress. Alagakanara is mentioned by Ibn Badata as ruling in Karunigala, but other sources indicate that he was the Bandara, guardian, of Raigama Koral, county, in the modern Kalutara district. Area Chakravarthi's army was held by Alagakanara in front of Kote while he defeated the enemy's invasion fleet at Panadura to the southwest. Kote was a Jaladarga, water fortress, in the shape of a triangle, with the Dawana Oi and Kolanawa Oi Am marshes forming two long sides, along the shorter third, land, side a large moat, the inner moat, was dug. The fortress was nearly 2.5 square kilometers, one square mile an area, fortified with ramparts of kabuk or laterite rock, 2.5 meters high and 10.7 meters in breadth. In 1391, following the conquest of the Jaffna kingdom by Prince Sapumal, Simbahab Perumal, Kote was given the epithet Sri Jayawardhanapura, resplendent city of growing victory. It became the capital of the ancient kingdom of Kote which it remained until the end of the 16th century. From the ramparts to the magnificent three-storied buildings that housed the king's palace, laterite and clay were the main raw material used in its construction. One of the places from which the laterite blocks were mined, could be seen even today inside the Anandasastralaya, a local school, premises. The main features of the capital city were dash. The king's palace, with walls of quartz that sparkle in the moonlight, Kandrakantapasana, and a golden spire, with beautiful flower gardens and springs of water. The three-story Dalada Malagawa with Buddha's sacred tooth relic in it, temple of the tooth the five-storied Arama where sixty Buddhist bhikkhus resided, with a Singh Araja high priest as the chief incumbent. The king's treasure housed the Kote Thara at Badagana, the only Buddhist temple of the city outside the moat and rampart. The royal cemetery at Badagana, Varakanda Memorial Dhyangampitiya, the military parade and training ground just inside the inner moat. The Portuguese arrived on the island in 1505 and were initially welcomed by the king but they had militaristic and monopolistic intentions and gained control of the city by 1565. Failing to withstand repeated assaults by the forces of the neighboring kingdom of Sitawaka, the city was abandoned by the Portuguese, who made Colombo their new capital. Like similar cities of that era, Sri Jayawardhanapura was built with security in mind. A rampart and moat protected the entire city. Traces of this moat and rampart are still visible today at certain places. Along parts of the rampart, encroachers have now built houses, garages and even toilets. The urbanization of Kote restarted in the 19th century. The archaeological remains were torn up and used as building materials, a process that continues some of it even ending up in the Victoria Bridge, across the Kalani River.